But I also think that in the pandemic, I'm more prone to laughing out loud than I ever have been because I'm just, my body is just like, like aching for some sort of like serotonin. So I'm just like, well, the pandemic is like, you don't laugh, you cry. Yeah. Anywhere I can get it. Yeah. Love Wedding Repeat, a film that I don't understand because all the men are like idiots and not really like attractive and all the women are hot babes. They're all, yeah, all the women stunning. I also recently watched Four Weddings and a Funeral, which I feel like I've talked about in this, on this podcast before where I've been like, I don't really like it. I don't really get it. But it's also because I never watched it in adulthood, I don't think. I love it. Have you, wait, did you change your perspective? Did you change your mind? Um, I think that. Come on, Granados, get, get on, get on board with me. I like the, I like this, this like stretch of a year or so where they're like meeting at all these different weddings and there's all these like events happening and it feels very true to like how a lot of my friends in England uh have had like summers that are just booked where it's like every weekend they have to go to a wedding um has he been eating good why does he look bigger I don't know maybe she's an angle (laughs) he's just like (laughs) he looks he looks he looks looks good he's just relaxing he's he He is yeah i think i genuinely think it's the angle what Uh, he's just big eve i know he's just yeah he's a he's a he's a healthy weight he's good like what um do you think some of the worst films of this genre have done like what are the mistakes that they've done since it is like such a formula This might sound odd, but kind of one of the most disappointing things for me is when you're really in it, you're in the drama, and then, like, the original couple still kind of gets married. Like, you know what I mean? It kind of feels, yeah. Like, like, I don't mean, like, my best friend's wedding. I mean, like, like, when there's all this kind of drama around them, they still just, everything's, like, hunky-dory. And like you feel like you've been on this journey, but like nothing has changed, right? Sort of thing. Um, another kind of cliche is when they're at the altar, and then one's just like runs or like is like no. Mm. Hmm. I I did not put Runaway Bride on this list. That is such a weird movie. It's like you just can't start with Pretty Woman and then like go to that. Like no. you just can't. It is like, like the Hawaiian that- theme. It's like so weird. It's very conservative. Like Richard Gere is like a, it's like actually like a misogynistic journalist. Like he's no, he's like stop following her, stop harassing <laughs> her. 